guys I am going to be doing a little haul video today and this is more of a collective haul I didn't get all of this stuff at once and I will go ahead and um, I think this is four separate orders I've been ordering from Bath and Body Works like crazy lately and I I have no explanation so I'm gonna go ahead and actually start in the order in which I got the packages in the mail and I'm just going to like set them off to the side. I'm trying to switch it up and order things, I mean, and film things in a different location right now, so that's why I am in this corner. So it all started with the Black Friday sale that they had had, and I know for a fact I got this box on Black Friday. I believe it was like 30 bucks. And I'm just gonna go ahead and light this little candle and put it off to the side because why not? So in the Black Friday box, there was this candy cane single wick candle, which is the one I'm going to light right now. So I also want to add that in the Black Friday box, there was also a little candy cane hand cream and a Santa Claus hand sanitizer holder that had like a little jingly bell and then an actual little hand sanitizer that went with it but I brought those all to work those are all in my brush belt at work so I can't actually show those to you but I saved everything else and put it in the box just so I could show you guys so the next thing in the box is this three wick candle it is the tis the season candle and I saw this thing on TikTok about um there's a line on the candles and that means that it's been lit before if it like goes down a little bit what do you guys know about that I don't know if it's true or not but I want to know what you guys have heard or what you know about that this candle it's it almost smells like a fall candle more so than Christmas it's red apple cinnamon and cedarwood I really like it though it smells pretty good then there was this Dahlia body spray. There is this Tis the Season foaming hand soap. Can never have too many of the hand soaps. This Dahlia shower gel and then also the Dahlia lotion. So this actually smells so good and I'm trying to figure out what it smells like so I can tell. Here it is. So the scent is Velvet Dahlia Petals Crisp Pear Praline Musk and Whipped Tonka Bean. It smells really I don't know it's like feminine but it's not like super overwhelming I don't know I just really like it and I'm glad that that was in there because I've never heard of it maybe that's why it's in the box so that's where all the sales started and then I know I went in and got some candles I don't I honestly don't know which ones I got okay so I had ordered candles and I think all the ones that I got second are on the top of this box. I believe I already lit one of them. It's somewhere in the house. So I got the Mary Cookie three wick candle. These were not the nine, $9 candles. I think these were like 15 something but then there was a promotion that I had. So I just went ahead and got all the stuff because it was Black Friday as well. So I got the Merry Cookie Holiday. I'm pretty sure it's it's cinnamon, nutmeg, and essential oils. So it's pretty close to the other one. I absolutely hate when I order these candles and it's cold outside because like when they come arrived in the mail and it's cold, they either end up shattered or looking really gross like this one. It's got like chunks of wax just laying all over it. Oh, this one's good. Snowflakes and citrus. You can definitely smell the citrus in there and there is a little hint of mango as well. Then the vanilla bean marshmallow. The packaging on this one is so cute and the color of the candle is cute as well. It just says vanilla and marshmallow on there. See, I really like this. It smells like sugar cookies to me, but it is a little bit, a little bit super sweet so I have to really be in the mood for this kind vanilla is one of my favorite scents but I have to be in the mood for it it's weird then we have the stress relief I just thought this would be a good one to have like in this office area when I'm editing videos or something like that on my computer I just thought this would be a good one it kind of goes with the whole like vibe of the room I guess yeah I really like this one so this one's eucalyptus and spearmint I don't think you can really go wrong with that kind of a scent. So now I'm going to jump into this other box that I got. It's a little box. I did have another package coming and it has not arrived yet which is weird because they're coming in the order like the stuff I ordered the latest is arriving before 
My dog's snorting in the background. The stuff that I ordered forever ago is coming after the stuff that I ordered more recently. That is what I'm trying to say. So I purchased this stuff separate from everything else. I don't know why I do this. I'm like, ooh, they gave me a $16 free gift. Let me go give them my money and they, they get me every time. So I got uh, two little room sprays, one of them being the Vanilla Bean Noel. I don't know why, but I love this vanilla more than any of the other ones. I don't know if there's something special about it, but I just like this one like more than the Merry Cookie or the Vanilla Marshmallow or anything else. Vanilla, vanilla Bean Noel is my favorite one. Then the other room spray that I got is the Endless Weekend, but I, I like this one. I know that I like this one. It just smells like a fresh, summery day, kind of. That's, that's how I would describe it. I guess I'd actually got three room sprays, not two. Surprise. This one is white tea and sage. This one almost smells kind of like laundry for some reason to me. I, I don't, I'm really bad at describing smells, but this one's really fresh too. And then I just ordered some wallflowers because I, I hoard them and you can never have too many wallflowers. I like to have one in every other room pretty much. And the sun-drenched linen is one of my favorites. It just smells like really warm, clean laundry and I love that because then I can put it in my bedroom or the bathroom and it just reminds you of like clean sheets or clean towels and I like it a lot. And then white balsam vanilla. Don't know why I got that one. I don't even really know what it smells like, but I'm sure it's not as good as Vanilla Bean Noel. What else did we get? Oh, I got Laundry Day. I don't know exactly what this one smells like. I'm sure it smells good. It says fresh pear, crisp eucalyptus, and soft lavender. That sounds pretty good. And then Sweater Weather is one of my favorite scents of all time. I don't know why, but the fall candles are always my favorite. Well, most of them are. Um, leaves, Sweater Weather, and Marshmallow Fireside are my favorite scents by far. So like I said, there is another package that I'd ordered, but I have not gotten it yet, which is weird because I ordered it a long time ago. So now we're going into the Candle Day Sale candles that I got. So I originally, I woke up at like 5.30 in the morning for candle day. Not intentionally, it's just my body was like, wake up and check your phone and order some candles. So it's 5.30 a.m. and I went on there, I went as fast as I could. The site was so slow. I added nine candles to my cart and out of the nine, I only was able to receive six because they were like completely sold out pretty much within the first like couple hours which kind of irritates me but at the same time I'm I'm jealous of the girls that were smart enough to like set that timer to do that because I should have done that but I don't remember which ones that I did not receive because I was just going so quick I just wanted to get stuff in my cart but I'm gonna show you the ones that I was able to get the six out of the nine that I ordered so the you're the one my camera cut off while I was talking but um yeah white birch velvety rose and a drop of strawberry nectar I can definitely smell the strawberry it's kind of it I don't know it is a romantic type of a scent but a romantic strawberry scent <laughs> then we have linen sheets like I would said before you can't go wrong with the linen it just makes everything feel clean yeah this smells like like clean bed sheets at a hotel or something. Next we have winter candy apple, candied apples, crisp pears, and oranges. I do like this one though. You can definitely smell the orange, but it's different. Vanilla bean noel, I could not pass up on this one. God, why is this so much different to me? Okay, we're gonna read it. Vanilla bean, marshmallow fluff, and vanilla cake. That is what it is, it's the vanilla cake. I absolutely I absolutely love the smell and flavor of like cake or cake batter type things. That is probably why I like this one so much. Okay, we have two more. We have sea salt and linen. Here we go back again with the linen. This one is driftwood, sea salt, lavender, and dried linen. This one's okay. The lavender in this one kind of gives it a little bit of a weird scent that I'm not sure how I feel about. It's okay. And then last but not least, this one I did save for last on purpose because I don't know why, but I really love this one. It's the peppermint sugar cookie. 
Um, crushed peppermint, vanilla extract, creamy butter, soft sugar cookies. I don't know, it's just so good. It's a weird kind of combination to be like, oh my gosh, I like it, but I, I do. All right, you guys, so that is it for this haul. I know it was a little bit all over the place, but I really just wanted to get this video up because I want to be able to put the stuff away and I've been putting it off so I could film it. But if you guys like this video and want to keep seeing more like haul type videos, whether it be Bath and Body Works or Amazon or something, let me know or give this video a thumbs up to let me know and I will continue to do that. And I'm going to try to switch up the locations in the room to give you guys like a different type of a background from now on. So. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this video and I will be seeing you guys in my next one very soon. Just make sure that you hit the subscribe button down below and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys!